Oh God, I actually took out quite, I took a lot out. I think it was about reinforcement of my own environment. Um, the purpose and the reason as to why I'm doing things and making sure that I'm clear. Um, I took out the opportunity, I suppose, or the benefits that the horses react or they respond straight away to what's, wo what's working well. Um, and not, not just to keep doing things because that's what you've been doing all the time and be responsive to how the horses respond to you. Um, there's only a few things but I actually took out a huge amount of things and I just sort of got to probably sit back and, and think about it. What did you learn about yourself? Um, I, it's always those like self-awareness. Um, I think those battles that you do have with yourself, your expectation that sometimes you're just going to go in there and do what you think, what, what you want to do and as I say not responding maybe to how the players are reacting, um, whether they're stimulated or challenged, you're just sort of really focused on what you want to do. Um, Self-awareness was huge and that was probably one of the main things that really stood out and highlighted during these last couple of days. How is it going to change your coaching when you get back to work? Um, I've learnt a lot and what I probably have to do is really sit back and prioritise because I think I learnt so much that I've, I don't want to go into work and change everything. I think I've got to really prioritise the most important things, the things that um, I know is going to make a big shift for the girls and that's for me it's based around consistency, uh, that the message, messages are clear and strong um, and that I'm responsive to the needs um, and I do build that relationship and it's a meaningful relationship that's not what I see. Um, and those are probably the things that I, I reckon that will make the biggest investment for our environment. What would you say to individuals or a team thinking about undertaking the programme? Um, it's a huge challenge and when you do come in and just the, the fear I suppose that we felt or I felt when I did see the horse and you know when, when you're teaching people new things everyone's always going to have that fear. Um, one of the things, you know, sometimes we always look at the other person instead of looking at ourselves, how we portray ourselves, what body language that we have. These horses show that automatically and they show it right from the start. Um, they're beautiful creatures actually um, and they respond very fast to great leadership. Um, and that's the challenge I think of why we're here and just the yearning to be better.